My name is Adriana. I came to East Hollywood High School because I like the idea of smaller classes, a lot less students, and it just seemed a lot more fun than a regular high school. My old school compared to East Hollywood is, is it seems like, it seems like really dull now, thinking about it. It was a lot bigger than East Hollywood, and I, I don't like crowds. I don't really like some of the people there. I like most of the people here. They're all really unique and open, accepting. My parents recently got divorced of March of this year. Um, I'm, I was with my mom at the beginning of this year, so I started last year's school year. My family situation before the divorce uh, was all right. It was my old, my parents, my older sister, my younger sister, and myself. And my parents would fight, but they would always make their fighting like private, so we never really knew what they were fighting about or what they were discussing. Um, my parents would talk a lot, and so me and my older sister would just go upstairs and talk, and we had our we had our own thing. But so because my parents were fighting so much, I thought it would be better if if my mom left if we started separate lives, if they started separate lives. But um, when she moved in with someone else, um, I never really saw my dad that emotional and it was really hard seeing like someone you look up to so much sad and then seeing your mom isn't, isn't phased at all. She just, she started a new life. And so that was really, that was really hard. I wrote a lot during that time, time my mom left. I would write about different people with like kind of in the same situation, but not really. I don't really like to write about myself very often. I like to write mostly about other people and how they deal with something. And then I'm like, oh, maybe, maybe I can do that. Beginning of last year, I was with my mom. I mean, my mom never really got along. I was always closer with my dad. And so I never, I didn't have my dad there to talk to and I didn't have my other sister to talk to. So I didn't really have anyone. But I always wrote and it always helped me feel better. I'll be like really sad one day and I'll write something really, really emotional. And I somehow move on from it. And then I'll look at it from the next week. I can be really, really sad the next week. And I'll look back at it and I'll be like, I moved on from that. So I can, I can move on from this too. Writing now, I'm a lot happier now. I mean, I go to an amazing school and I live with my dad and I have my other sister here. So writing now isn't, isn't because I'm sad, it's because it's something I love to do.